<clears throat> so mom's been standing here 15 or 20 minutes. Got her in an upright position, but I can't get her to move. She gets just stuck in time. <clears throat> mom, you need to walk to the kitchen for your food. Can you move your right foot? Can you hear me? Where are you going? I need to fix that one curtain. It looks crappy sagging like that. Come on, Mom. Come on. Let's get to the kitchen so you can eat. All right, come on. Can you move your feet? <clears throat> Just walk towards me, okay? Walk towards me. Mom, can you walk? Can you walk? All right, move your right foot. Shh. No, you want to sit down in the kitchen so you can eat. Come on, start walking. Start walking. Food is the absolutely only motivator we have anymore. The absolutely only one. Don't always give her food, but I always bribe her with it. So now she's getting busy moving her walker around. And she'll move that around and around and around, but she won't move herself. Come on, Mom. Walk this way, okay? I'm going to help you get to the kitchen. Come on. Usually, once she takes that first step, she might keep going. Come on, keep walking. And there's absolutely nothing wrong with her physically. The physical therapist says she has amazingly strong legs. It's 100% in the brain. So, it only took, what, 40 minutes? Yeah, 25 minutes for her brain to engage into walk mode this morning. Keep following me, okay? This is May 17th, probably, 2014. Okay, keep following me. See if we can get her to the bathroom. Follow me, Mom. Mom, now keep your hand on your walker. She wants to use anything but a walker. Come on, follow me. Come on. I'm not looking forward to a bad ridden Mom. What kind of quality of life is there in that? Just enjoy my meals, that's about it. <laughs> come on, Mom. Now, come this way. Don't head for that. F Mom, come this way. Come this way. No, no, come this way. Bring your walker. No, Mom. 
You have to hold on to your walker. You have to hold on to your walker. Now f come with me. Come on. Just hold on to your walker and come on. You're doing good. Come on, don't look that way. Come, no, no. Ugh. Keep your hand on the walker. Put your hand down here. Okay, now follow me. Follow me. Come on. I'm not talking yet this morning either. Which means we're not getting sati. Hee 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 hee. Or e e e e e e e e e e e e. Because those are about the only two choices anymore. Come on, keep coming. Come on. Keep coming. <sighs> Sorry, I'm making you all sick. Okay, go in the bathroom here. Soak through as usual. There's no diaper that could hold in her overnight flow. Oh, thank God for underwear that Debbie buys and disposable underpads that Medi-Cal pays for. Or Medicare. Or Medicaid. I don't know which is which. I think Medi-Cal is California's Medicaid. So it's Medicare and Medi-Cal, but I don't know which pays for which. See, she got the, she knows where she has to go. She's got a lot of muscle memory. Her brain doesn't know, but. Okay, try to preserve a little dignity here. Huh? Watch her wipe her snot on her shirt. <laughs> She had stopped pulling down her pants at Andy's house, where there's no raised toilet. Actually, she was pulling them down a little bit. She just couldn't change them. Oh, yeah, and she got her underwear this time. See, she even knew it wasn't down far enough. Okay, good job, Mom. Good job. Let's see. That's good. Perfect. 
All right, can you take off your wet pads? All right, I need you to take off your wet pants, okay? Can you take off your wet pants and put them on here? Mom, pull down your pants. Ouch. Take these off, okay? Whoops, there's poop in them. You better take them off. No, no, sit down. You have to take your poopy pants off. Poopy pants off. Yeah, take them off. Oops. poop all down the leg so I'm gonna go now and shower her fun